I'm looking a bit like a bowl. Hi everyone, it's Stella from OS Stella and I have the second part of my Eliza Becker videos. Uh, today I'm going to be talking to you guys about these masks that I got from them. And my camera's running out of battery. Oh, just a moment, I'm going to change that battery. Hi everyone, it's Stella from OS Stella. Again, I'm back. Um, both of my batteries are completely dead, so... I had to charge and get started again. So these are the three step mask pack. So these, as you can tell, they have three steps. There is a cleansing step, a essence step, and a sheet mask step. And it goes to the sheet mask. So for these masks, they actually have three different types and they've really generously sent me all three. So they have this one that is the pore solution one, which is for blackheads. Um, the aqua white water, I assume this is the um, whitening one. So this one has vitamin C in it, I assume, because this is a whitening one. And then the anti-aging one. Um, I do use a few anti-aging products, but um, I mean I'm 26 so I don't really need this so much so I might be letting my mom use this one instead. So instead today I'm going to try on one of these on camera for you guys. So I'm actually just looking at the information on my phone and according to this one the anti-aging and whitening pack both have sort of, um, they're like the traditional sheet masks, but the pore mask is actually a black one, but um, I don't think that it's a, it's not a peel off one, I don't think. Um, the first step for all of them is a cleansing foam, which helps to manage pores, oil, the usual stuff. And then next is a water essence, which is that one, and then the mask pack. Um, according to the website, this uh, pink one, the pore solution one, the mask one actually helps to brighten the skin and improve wrinkles, like anti-wrinkle, which I'm a little bit confused about because this is the pore control, not the brightening one, but what can you do? I've been having a lot of pore issues lately, so I think I'm going to try the pore one, especially since the mask pack is a little bit different. So these are already perforated. So you can very easily just split this into the three. So then you've got your cleansing stage first. I'm just going to go do this into the bathroom. So um, you probably won't see me cleaning my face on here. Because I don't want to get my carpet all dirty. But I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back and I've cleansed my face. Um... It was like a really foamy so cleanse and it's cleaned my face really well but um, I'm, I was feeling a little bit of dragging with it so I think it's a little bit drying. I'm not crazy about that cleanser but we'll see how the rest of it goes. Put this on the back of my hand. Oh, okay. Okay, so there's quite a lot of this so I was like you don't really have to be stingy with this one then. This smells, it's quite light, it does have a bit of a scent, but I quite like the smell. It reminds me of, I don't know, it reminds me of a cosmetic store. I don't really know how to describe it, it's not like fruity or anything, so it's not, it's not over the top sort of scent. It's just nice, it's a nice light scent. I mean, aside from on your hands, you also can't really smell it that much. I didn't want to accidentally cut the mask because that would be sad. Okay. I can't believe I just sniffed it. A very light scent. It's not really anything like crazy. Uh, it's quite saturated. Like I have a feeling my, sh my shirt, I'm going to get so many droplets on my shirt. I already got some water on my shirt. I should have worn black. It's quite a, it's quite a thick material. Not super thick, just a little bit thicker than I expected it to be. 
and the serum is like the essence that's on it is quite sort of like satiny. All right, let's do this. Ready? Ready? Oh wow! Oh, I look incredible. I'm looking at my screen on my camera, but I can't actually see things like oh, can't see things really well. This is like. This is like silky. So it's actually, this feels really nice. Like it's really smooth. On the hand. There's actually some like, I think there's quite a bit of essence left in this as well. I'm just going to take it out and apply it to my face as well. Alright, I am going to disappear for a while and come back when this is ready to be taken off. All right, everyone, it's been about 20 minutes and I'm ready to take this off. Let's go. It's still quite wet. Like, honestly, if I wore it for a bit longer, it'd be okay. But for the sake of this review, I am completely following instructions. So it definitely wasn't a peel off mask, but I can, ooh, I do think it's got like a really good brightening effect. I don't know if it's just my lights that's making it look like that. Um, there's still quite a bit of essence, so I'm just going to gently pat that in, I think. Okay, so onto the mask. I can definitely see a brightening. I really think it's made my face look pretty good. Like, I'm just looking at the camera, it looks pretty nice. Um, as for pores, oh, I'm not, to be honest, I'm not seeing that much of a difference, like, I've still got a few kind of like, enlarged pores that I think are still there. Honestly, pores wise, I don't think that this has really like, cleared out my pores or anything, but um, it has brightened. And it's definitely hydrated really well. The mask is like really, it's really nice. It's not too thin, it's not too thick, and it's super hydrated. So, I don't know what do you guys think. I, I'm a little bit torn because I, really, I was really hoping that this would really clear up my pores. But I think that in all other aspects, it's done a pretty good job. Um, I'm kind of interested to see what these other ones would do. So let me know in the comments if you guys have used this before, what you think of it. And if you want to buy it for yourself, it's available on Eliza Becker's website, which I'll also link below. Um, it is now 10.30. I have a photo shoot tomorrow. So I'm checking out for tonight. I hope you enjoyed this video. Remember, comment, subscribe, like, follow me on Instagram, all that other stuff. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.